used in chemical warfare, yet the EPA is saying there's nothing to see here, the water's fine when you've got thousands of fish for miles popping up dead, dead animals, people saying they're nauseous, they can't breathe, their eyes are burning. And I can't help but wonder, to Sean's point, if this was happening in Ukraine, would the left care more? Would the media care more instead of a Trump county? Is that why this has been ignored for so long by most of the media? And, and beyond that, I, I wonder, is something bigger at play here? There just seems to be too many things going on in the country. You're talking about multiple flying objects. We're talking about multiple train derailments. We're talking about the FAA for the first time since 9-11 grounding all planes. We're talking about power outages going out on Capitol Hill. Social media went down recently. Airports with power outages. So I, I don't know. It just seems to be a lot of things co coinciding at the exact same time for it to just be and a coincidence. And that's the thing. So for anybody who would argue, oh, that's conspiracy thinking, talking, when you are so silent with the facts and people are living lives with doubt and with pain and with death now of their livestock, what do you think they're going to do? What do you think they're going to think? If you aren't going to help them, they're suffering. They're going to think nefarious things about the people who refuse to help. Oh, and